Hey friends, this video is for anyone who has trouble memorizing songs. I have a couple of tips for you. Number one, learn a song that only has two chords because then you're not gonna have to worry about remembering what chord comes next. You're gonna know it's either C or G7 or maybe it's F and C7 or whatever the two chords are. This way your brain has to think about fewer things. It already has to think about the words you're singing, the chords you're playing, what you're strumming. So just taking out what chord comes next is going to be really helpful for you. So pick a song that has two chords. Then once you've mastered that, pick a song that has three chords and pick a song where the three chords go in the loop. So maybe the chords are A, D, and E and they just keep repeating A, D, E, A, D, E. And so then you don't have to think about what chord is coming next because you know that after A comes D, after D comes E, after E comes A, and it just goes around in a loop. Once you can do that, pick a song that has four chords that go in a loop. And one really good example of this is the song Stand By Me. This song has the chords C, A minor, F, and G in it, and it just goes in that order throughout the whole song. So pick a song with just a few chords, chords that go in a loop, so there's one less thing to think about. Memorize the lyrics and then put it all together. And remember, if you don't have a song memorized and you have to look at the music, there's absolutely no shame in that. Sometimes we have to do that in order to get the song memorized. We have to repeat it over and over and over. But picking a song that has just a few chords that go around in a loop is one sure way to help you memorize your song. If you have any further questions about that, let me know. Thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.